Yeah, Ron Wyden has been looking into Harlan Crow. Harlan Crow, of course, is the right-wing billionaire who is uh, not only funding um, the Republicans, but uh, and and Clarence Thomas, famously, you know, bought Clarence Thomas's mother's house and put Clarence Thomas's kid through school and and uh, took Clarence Thomas on millions of dollars worth of vacations, but. Uh, you know, is also funding, uh, according to press reports, uh, a, a major funder of no labels, which may be, you know, the secret weapon that the Republicans have this year. They, they know that Don, there's no way Donald Trump could beat Joe Biden in an actual matchup. But if they could peel enough votes away from Biden with a third party candidate, with Joe Manchin or Bobby Kennedy or whoever, then maybe they can do it, right? They're going to try this. So anyhow, that's, that's, um, that's Harlan Crow, and, and he's got this yacht. It's called the Michaela Rose. And on his tax filings, he's showing that his yacht, or the company that owns his yacht, has lost $8 million on it. And yet, also in his filings and in his uh, registration of the vehicle, he claims that it's purely a pleasure vehicle, that it's never used for business. Well, you know, it, 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 think about this in terms of cars, for example. You know, you might have known somebody uh, who was a, a, a salesperson who had to drive a lot. Well, you know, you can deduct some of the expenses associated with your car if you have to drive for work. You can deduct, uh, you know, mileage. You can deduct depreciation, wear and tear. You can deduct repairs, uh, you know, depending on how you do it and how you organize it. But basically, you know, if you're using your car in your business, it becomes a tax deductible expense. But he's, and so he's got this yacht that he takes Clarence Thomas and Jenny Thomas out on. And he's saying, you know, it's a business. We lost $8 million. But at the same time, he's saying, no, it's not a business. Uh, it's just purely for pleasure. And so Ron Wyden wrote him a letter saying the tax code makes abundantly clear that the use, use of a super yacht for personal purposes is not a legitimate business use, and therefore any related cost cannot be claimed as a deduction. Any effort to characterize a yacht used as a pleasure craft as a business is a run-of-the-mill tax scam, plain and simple. And then he goes on, Ron Wyden goes on to say, you know, your prior uh, responses to this committee have not... <laughs> Uh, have done nothing to address the committee's concern that personal trips to host friends such as Justice Thomas aboard the McKella Rose have been used to help Mr. Crow avoid or evade paying federal taxes. Additionally, the committee has obtained significant new evidence that the McKella Rose was not registered with the appropriate maritime authorities as a yacht engaged in trade and transporting charter passengers for hire. This directly undermines claims Mr. Crow has made to various branches of the federal government that the McKellar Rose was a commercial vessel engaged in for-profit yacht chartering activities. Very strange stuff.